I am back with another interesting video and in this video we will see how we can use Gmail and as a send mail email relay okay let's go to the terminal and sudo dash i to get into the privilege mode okay now um, I will skip that part but basically you need to do yum update dish one okay so now when the update is done let's um, check the version number of the uh, of the CentOS so Red Hat dish release CentOS 7.6 let's check what is in the host name it is the same as if you run the hostname command and let's check the host files okay. uh, so that's what we have in the host so that should be pretty much a default for most of you and the command is yum install epel dash release dash y okay so the command is so it will install send mail send mesh send mail dash cf m4 mail utils and mail x okay and after this installation we will have mail folder in the slash etc directory so uh, we are creating auth directory inside that mail directory okay this is the name of the file and it we are creating it in the auth directory okay so press enter so this username uh, having this password will be used to send email to um, anyone you want okay so let's save this and quit in that that art directory in which we just created the file if we do ls we have that file which we just created and now if we run this command mac map hash gmail art into gmail art it will we will get the encrypted version you see this new file is created <laughs> generic stable so vim slash ecc says mail and generic stable so mia mia is my username you might have your own username and this is the email that we were using to um, send uh, that we are using to send email so basically we want that when our send mail tries to contact gmail instead of mia and mia at the localhost.local .local domain it uses this email okay because if it uses if the send mail uses this email then uh, gmail will complain because this is not a valid email okay so let's store this and uh, if you can see ls paste okay and now if we do ls we got the generic stable db and it also create a send mail dash cf new send mail dash cf file on the basis of send mail dot mc so we will do vim send mail dot mc and we will go to the end of the line and we will just press i to insert and we will remove these three lines okay the last three lines okay this time it did so you will copy these lines remember and this is very important it it mentions uh, the file that we created uh, the .db file uh, here and here so they both should be there uh, and let's uh, save them let's enable it To the home directory cd vim and uh, test ch okay and now so this is the email to whom we want to send uh, an automatic email so basically a script will send an email from the email which we uh, run. so let's run this script 
and you can see that uh, it seems okay sent okay and everything seems fine okay recipient is two and uh, from Mia at the local host dot local domain um, so let's check that email to, and uh, let's log into that email enter the password And here you can see that we got the email uh, from that user okay so if you check the so it's from that test user to this test user so these are the two test users that I created for the testing purpose and um, they are sending the email fine in your case it will not work out of the box because you have to uh, enable a less secure app access in your gmail address so the address that you used let's uh, cd slash mail slash uh, cd slash etc slash mail slash up and uh, right and get up gmail up and you will go you will log into that email address let's log in and once you log in you have to allow the access of less secure app so to do that you will go to uh, Google account and uh, security and go down 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 yeah here so you see your less secure app access will be off okay so you have to turn this on okay so you have to click here uh, in my case it's already on otherwise it wouldn't work okay so that's the extra step that is required in gmail i hope you enjoyed the video uh, thank you for watching and please subscribe for more interesting videos thank you bye